Hello friends, my name is Silva Nahabedian and I'm the Director of Education for Dazzle Dry. You have probably been hearing about this nail polish system and are wondering what all the hype is about. Well, I am not only going to tell you what Dazzle Dry is, but I will also tell you why it works and how it works. We are going to go through all four steps together and I'm going to give you a lot of information, but I promise you it's super easy and not complex at all. The entire process should take you around 30 minutes. By the end of this video, you will be a Dazzle Dry aficionado and will be able to give yourself some self-love and a perfect at-home manicure or pedicure. You will only need to watch this video one time and you will be a bona fide Dazzle Dry DIYer. First, here's a little background about me. I'm a manicurist with over 25 years experience as a natural nail care specialist. I was actually forced into a career of natural nails because while attending beauty school, I realized I had a severe allergy to artificial enhancements such as acrylics, dips, and gels. I really had to set myself apart from everyone else by truly studying my craft and becoming the best natural nail care specialist I could possibly be. Through relentless research, I always had my finger on the pulse of all things that I thought were clean and healthy and cutting edge for natural nails. Little did I know there was so much misinformation and fear-based marketing around nail cosmetics, but more to come on that later. After becoming licensed, I quickly developed a reputation for giving the most detail and results-oriented manicures and pedicures. I had truly found my passion. My career eventually led me to LA, where I had the good fortune of working as a celebrity manicurist and was named Allure Magazine's best manicurist in Los Angeles. I got to do all kinds of fun nails for magazines, photo shoots, movie and commercial sets, celebrity house calls, red carpet events. Those experiences made for some good times and great stories that I'm eternally grateful for. In addition to my wild ride in Hollywood as a celebrity manicurist, I owned private nail studios in LA and Scottsdale for over two decades with a very loyal cult-like following. Fast forward to 2014, I was introduced to Dazzle Dry. And as a student of my craft, I got my hands on the system and began to apply it to test it on my clients to see if it lived up to its claims. I needed to see firsthand what was so unique about the system that nail professionals were buzzing about. I quickly realized I had found the holy grail of nail polish and was determined to tell anyone and everyone who would listen about why this product had revolutionized how we do our nails. After six months of using it, I got rid of over 500 bottles of nail polish from other brands and transitioned all of my clients to Dazzle Dry. What makes Dazzle Dry so unique? Dr. Vivian Valenti, the inventor and creator of Dazzle Dry. She has a PhD in bioorganic chemistry and has been innovating nail cosmetics since 1989. She is truly a legend in the nail industry. All right, now let's jump right into this super simple system. Dazzle Dry is a unique and proprietary formula utilizing a signature four-step system plus Revive. Just imagine a product that delivers high performance without the use of harsh chemicals or damage to the natural nails. I always like to say, although Dazzle Dry is not a complicated system, it has complexities that need to be understood. When it is used correctly, you will love the results and wonder where it has been your entire life. I promise you it will become a part of your self-care ritual. Stick with me as I guide you through the easy steps as you discover that Dazzle Dry is simply magical, unrivaled, and unmatched. Now, let's get into some of the key benefits. Dazzle Dry is vegan and cruelty-free. You're probably asking yourself, well, what in the world does vegan nail polish mean, Silva? We do not use any animal testing or animal byproducts. What animal byproducts could possibly be in nail polish, you ask? Wait for it. Pigments from crushed beetles or fish scales. These are ingredients that are often found in cosmetics. Gross, right? I know. We do not use any animal or insect byproducts. If you live a vegan lifestyle, you care just as much about what you're putting on your body as what you're putting in your body. 
Our polishes contain pigments that are FDA approved and mineral pigments only. Our system is hypoallergenic. This means that it does not contain reactive ingredients known to cause contact dermatitis, allergic reactions, or skin sensitivities. If you are someone who cannot wear traditional polish, gel polish, or hybrids because they cause reactions, you will love that we have taken the time to develop a system that you can wear successfully without any adverse effects. Dazzle Dry is non-toxic. Dr. Valenti dedicated 10 years of research and development before bringing it to market to ensure that it is the cleanest nail polish system that is safe for everyone. This means that it is free from harmful, carcinogenic, and endocrine disrupting toxins. So many people will ask if Dazzle Dry is three, six, nine, or 12 free. We do not subscribe to these fear-based marketing claims that can be misleading. Some companies list ingredients in their free claims that are not and never were used in nail polishes just to have a higher number of free from claim. We manufacture our products in-house to the highest quality and safety standards. Let me ask you a question. Have you ever taken your polish off your nails and noticed that they were stained yellow? We've all seen it. It's not a good look, right? Well, Dazzle Dry solves that issue. You will never have unsightly yellow nails again. And without geeking out too much on the science, the entire system is non-yellowing due to the absence of an ingredient known as nitrocellulose. No more gross yellow nails. So we have discussed that Dazzle Dry is vegan, it's hypoallergenic, it's non-toxic, it's non-yellowing, and these are all very important features. However, in my opinion, the best thing about Dazzle Dry is that it air dries in five minutes. You heard me correct, five minutes. How many times have you had your nails done or done them yourself and smudged them within minutes, ruining your entire manicure? Or how about this scenario? You do your nails at night and you wake up in the morning with sheet marks embedded in your polish. Ugh. We've all been there, right? All of my polish prayers were answered when I discovered Dazzle Dry. It checks all of the boxes for me and I know it will for you too. It is smudge proof one minute after applying top coat and completely dry in five minutes with no UV or no LED curing. That is the main reason why this system is so unique. In addition to the fact that it air dries super fast, it's also very long lasting. If proper instructions are followed, you will get chip free wear from seven to 14 days on the fingernails and a month or more on the toes. Beautiful long lasting nails are the ultimate low maintenance luxury. Pro tip, if it's not lasting a minimum of seven days, it is because you have not done the process correctly. You can keep watching and refer to our website FAQs at DazzleDry.com to troubleshoot. Hello, healthy nails. So how do you remove Dazzle Dry? Super simple. It comes off with regular polish remover, no soaking, no scraping, no filing needed. We offer two wonderful polish removers, an acetone and a non-acetone, and they both have essential oil, so they smell really pleasant. Before we discuss what Dazzle Dry is, let's discuss what it is not. Dazzle Dry is not a traditional polish. Let me ask you a question. What are some of the inherent issues with traditional polish? They take too long to dry and they chip quickly. So frustrating, especially after you've spent time and money to get them done. Dazzle Dry is not a gel polish either. What are some of the problems with gel polish? We love that it lasts so long and that it cures so quickly, but it can leave your nails weak and brittle, right? How many of us have experienced that? I call myself a natural nail care specialist. I felt like the biggest phony and fraud when I was doing gel polish on my clients and ruining their nails. I could not stomach the fact that as a nail professional, I was ruining their nails. 
trust me when I tell you that I'm the biggest rule follower and I was using the products correctly, but the damage was undeniable. And once that damage is done, it takes months for your natural nails to recover. I won't even get into the controversial and potentially harmful effects of UV or LED lights. Okay, so Dazzle Dry is not a traditional polish and it's not a gel polish. Finally, it's not a hybrid either. These polishes are typically a combination of traditional polish and gel polish combined together to create a hybrid that doesn't require UV or LED curing. Oftentimes in drugstores, you'll see brands that say no UV gel or no light gel. That's your indication that it's a hybrid. Although these can dry faster than traditional polish, they are laden with reactive ingredients that can stain the nails and cause them to become yellow and brittle. No thank you. Dazzle Dry is in none of those categories I just mentioned. It is a performance-based polish system in a standalone category because the chemical composition is completely unique to us. It is polish reinvented as the first in class and the best in class. Remember that Dazzle Dry is a system. All the components are scientifically engineered to function as a system. Do not separate the components or use other products when applying Dazzle Dry because all the components are designed to synergistically work together. For example, don't use our base coat or top coat with other brands of polish, and don't use our polish with other brands of base coat or top coat. It simply will not work, and you can risk adverse reaction by combining these products that were not designed to work together. I'm a licensed nail professional, and I'm in favor of you going to your favorite Dazzle Dry certified salon to get a professional manicure. However, if you don't want to or can't for any reason, you can give yourself a flawless manicure at home and I will walk you through the easy steps. I don't know about you guys, but for me, when my hands, my feet, and my brows are presentable, my confidence goes through the roof. Make doing your nails at home a beautiful ritual of self-love and self-care so you don't feel the need to hide your hands. Before you start your Dazzle Dry self-care ritual, make sure you have everything ready to go ahead of time. Get nice and organized. Just like if you were gonna bake cookies, you don't wanna start the process and realize you don't have brown sugar. Lay out all the items you see listed here prior to starting. Beauty services are not just frivolous vanity. They are an expression of self-love and self-care, so make it about that. Show up as your most confident and best self by taking time out for you. And P.S. Self-care is not selfish. Make it a meditative ritual to nurture your hands and your feet. I've already filed and shaped my nails and I also gave them a gentle buff. Before we dive into our application, I'm going to start by scrubbing my nails with soap and water. Let me explain why. Polish will not adhere if there's dirt, oil, or lotion present on the nails. So I'm using a clean nail brush to scrub each nail really well. Rinse your fingertips in water to remove the suds. Pat your hands dry and then proceed with Dazzle Dry nail prep. All the steps in the Dazzle Dry system are numbered to take the guesswork out of how to use it. Step number one in the system is nail prep. This is the most important step. Do not skip it because it will make your polish last longer. This step is designed to cleanse, sanitize, and moisturize the nails. One of the coolest things about our nail prep is that it is infused with pro-vitamin B5, calcium, and hydrolyzed wheat protein. Nail prep acts as your nail strengthener that fortifies the nails with nutrients that can promote good nail health. Most people are gonna notice a difference in the strength of their nails only after one use. There's a strategic way we recommend you use step number one. Use one lint-free pad per hand. Why, you ask? This little tip will ensure optimum cleanliness of the nail plate prior to polished application so that you're not transferring contaminants from one hand to the other. Uh, by the way, the reason why we suggest lint-free wipes is to avoid like those annoying little fibers that get into your polish. If you don't have any, don't worry. Just use cotton rounds and just dust off 
any lint that may get on your nails. Let's get started with our application and I will show you exactly how to scrub your nails. This is super important, so watch carefully. I'm saturating my lint-free wipes really well. One per hand. And we're gonna scrub. Watch this gangster move. <laughs> Rotate your pad to find a clean spot to ensure that you're not just pushing around dirt, oil, or lotion. Now that you have prepared your canvas, do not touch your nails to avoid transfer of oils from your fingertips onto the nails because this can cause premature chipping. Pro tip, never use acetone, polish remover, or alcohol to cleanse your nails as this can over dehydrate the nails and can cause chipping. Step number two in the system is base coat. Dr. Valenti formulated this unique base coat using flexible rubbery polymers to give your manicure longevity. It allows the manicure to flexibly expand and contract with the natural nail. Let me explain how this works. Our nails are porous, just like our hair, just like our skin. So when we wash our hands, wash dishes, take a shower, etc., our nails absorb water and they expand. When they dry, they contract. And this motion occurs all day long with our nails. And with all this expansion and contraction taking place, this is why traditional polishes crack and chip. This technology is unique to us and is one of the reasons why your manicure will last so long. Do you see how this bottle of base coat is cloudy? Let me break down why this happens. When the temperature drops below 70 degrees, it can cause the base coat to solidify into a jelly-like substance. This is not a defect. The base coat must be clear like water prior to application. I repeat, it must be clear like water. To achieve this, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna close the cap tight and stand it in one inch of hot water until it is completely clear. Do not run the bottle under a faucet or submerge it underwater. If water gets inside your base coat, it will become contaminated and it must be discarded. Sidebar, please do not ever microwave your base coat. Now that it is declouded, this is what it looks like. It's completely clear like water. And we're going to apply it by dipping the brush in the bottle for each nail, swipe one side of your brush on the inner neck of the bottle, allow the excess product to flow back into the bottle. You will notice that it is very thin, almost watery. Don't apply it too heavy so you don't flood the skin with base coat. Coming in contact with skin can cause lifting and chipping, but if you get base coat on the skin, don't worry. Clean it up right away with a detail brush or orange wood stick dipped in pure acetone, and here's what it looks like. Here's what we call a cleanup brush. Uh, you could use an orange wood stick, and also, if you have like an angled eyeliner brush at home, you can use this too. If you have long enough free edge, this is the white part of your nail that extends beyond the tip. Encapsulate each nail by running the tip of the brush along the tip of your nail. If your nails are short like mine, you can skip that encapsulation. And by the way, I'm that weird person that can't stand any free edge on my nails. I always file my nails very short. I know some of you can relate to that. It is so important to allow each layer to dry matte prior to applying the next layer. It doesn't dry to a chalky matte, but rather it no longer looks wet like water. It can get gummy if the second layer is applied while the first one is still wet. This is super important so that you don't end up with a clumpy manicure or contaminate your bottle by transferring semi-wet rubbery polymers back into your bottle. Make sense? All the layers dry very quickly. By the time you complete all 10 nails, the first nail should be dry. Repeat the second layer of base coat. Remember to allow it to dry matte prior to applying the color. 
I know I'm giving you a lot of information, a lot of instructions, but I promise you it's easy peasy and you've got this. Notice that the second layer of base is not quite as matte as the first layer. Don't let the slight sheen throw you off. Pro tip, don't touch your nails to check to see if it's dry as this can transfer oils from your fingertips and cause premature chipping. Now that my base coat is dry, let's move on to our beautiful polishes, step number three in the system. We have around 150 gorgeous creams, shimmers, and glitters, and we release new colors as we become inspired to create new trends. So now, just put something down so that you make sure you protect whatever surface you're working on. And today, I'm gonna go with my favorite red called Lit. And now that we have applied two layers of base, we're ready for step number three. Because Dazzle Dry polishes dry so quickly, there's a trick to applying them to avoid streaking or disrupting the previous layer. The key is more polish on your brush, minimal pressure on your brush, and work mostly with the tip of your brush for best results. You're gonna notice that I don't press hard and fan out the bristles, you wanna go easy on the first layer and a little more generous on the second layer. After shaking the polish to resuspend the pigment, dip the brush in the bottle for each nail and swipe one side of the brush on the inner neck of the bottle and allow excess product to just flow back into the bottle. Now you see how the belly of the brush is loaded with polish on one side? That is what you are looking for. Now we're going to apply the first layer of polish using about a medium consistency. Not too thin, not too thick. When I set the brush down, I don't butt the brush up to the cuticle. I keep a small margin between the brush and the cuticle and push the brush towards your cuticle to form your guideline. Then I run the brush down both sides of the nail and finally smooth out any imperfections until I get the desired coverage. You want to apply enough product so that it's not too streaky, but it's not quite full coverage just yet. That comes with the second layer. Remember, the key when applying your Dazzle Dry Manicure is to allow each layer to dry matte prior to applying the next layer. I cannot emphasize this enough. Typically, by the time you're finished with the second hand, the first hand is already dried matte. Pro tip, let it air dry. Don't touch it, don't use a fan, don't blow on your nails or flap your hands. We're not trying to take flight here. All of these common practices can impact adhesion. Also, keep in mind you should avoid contact with skin to prevent lifting and chipping. However, don't worry if you get it on the skin. I'm a pro and I still get it on the skin. Simply clean it up as you go with your detail brush or orange wood stick dipped in pure acetone to perfect your application. Same as with the base coat. Encapsulate each nail if they are long enough. Notice that our custom brushes do most of the work for you. The precision laser cut bristles beautifully hug the cuticle area and creates your guideline for that flawless application. The second layer may be applied generously. Be mindful of not applying too heavily so that the polish doesn't roll to one side or pull. Now we will let this layer dry matte prior to applying top coat to finish our manicure. You see how easy this is? I have all the confidence in you that you can do this. I will let you in on another pro tip. When using our glitters, shimmers, or metallics, the application is slightly different. Apply these colors in thin layers to prevent premature chipping. You may do a third layer if needed. Step number four in our system is our top coat. Dazzle Dry top coat is high gloss, non-yellowing, quick drying, long wearing, and self leveling. You don't have to be a master polisher. If there are any minor imperfections in the polish application, the top coat will self level and smooth it all out. It is goof proof. Remember to never, ever, ever warm the top coat. The base coat should be warm to decloud it, but never the top coat. Once your second layer of polish has dried matte, you're going to apply a generous layer of top coat. Use the tip of the brush to glide over and burst any air bubbles that may have formed while it is still wet 
And it also helps to have really good overhead lighting so that you can make sure you see well. Now that we have applied top coat, that is it. That is your dazzle dry application process. You see how easy that was? No drying drops, no sprays, no lights, no dryers. Wait five minutes, your polish is completely dry. Pro tip, to prevent dulling of your top coat, avoid coming in contact with alcohol-based products. If your manicure does dull, you can simply touch it up with one layer of base coat, followed by one layer of top coat. This will refresh your shine and extend the life of your manicure. Now that it's been five minutes, this is the moment of truth. Can you guys hear that? I mean, how impressive is that? I'm literally stabbing this and there's nothing. It looks perfect. Isn't this impressive? Dazzle Dry truly gives you your time back and your life back in just five minutes. You don't have to wait 24 hours like you do with traditional polish for all the layers to dry and fuse together. Five minutes is all it takes and you're completely, completely dry. Now you can dig into your purse. You can put on your seat belt. You can brush your teeth, wash your face, whatever it is you need to do, it gives you your life back and you're not gonna smudge your nails. That's the beauty of Dazzle Dry. Let's talk about a vital component of the system called Revive. I like to tell people, you can't have a polish system that air dries in five minutes and not expect it to get thick. Dazzle Dry polish and top coat will get thick period. And Revive is your best friend and a vital component of the system. It's not a typical thinner, so do not fear it. Adding Revive will not change the color or impact the efficacy of the products like other thinners do. With routine use of Revive as needed in your polish and top coat, you will be able to use the products to the last drop to maximize your investment. So Silva, how often do I add Revive? Let me explain. First of all, you have to be the judge of when to add Revive. Once the polish is thick, no longer fluid or smooth, that's your indication that it's time to add Revive. When your top coat gets thick or forms air bubbles, these are your indications that you need to add Revive. There's no limit to the number of times you will need to add Revive to the polishes or the top coat. The base coat will never need Revive. In fact, if you accidentally add Revive to the base coat, it must be discarded. Let me show you how to add Revive to your polish. Fill the dropper, and you're gonna add about six to eight drops at a time. Shake it well. Think of it like cooking with salt. Start with less, and you can always add more if needed until that desired viscosity is achieved. And this is the fluid drip you're looking for. See, that's what you want it to look like when you add Revive. Same with the top coat. You're gonna start with six to eight drops of Revive at a time. Instead of shaking the top coat, you're going to roll it in one direction to avoid air bubbles. So remember, you shake your polish and roll your top coat after adding Revive. Now let's talk about Transform. This superhero product is sure to become a staple in your Dazzle Dry manicure. Transform will smooth out ridges and other nail imperfections. It creates this beautiful gel-like surface. It neutralizes the color of your nail bed to make any Dazzle Dry color just pop. Consider yourself warned, you will get addicted to the flawless appearance of your manicure with the use of Transform. The preparation is the same, whether you use Transform or not, saturate one lymph-free cotton pad per hand with nail prep, scrubbing each nail thoroughly. Then apply two layers of base, allowing each layer to dry matte. Now apply one layer of Transform and allow to dry for five minutes. Once that is dry, apply one layer of base over Transform to allow it to dry matte. Now apply two layers of polish, allowing each layer to dry matte. And finally, apply one layer of top coat and allow to dry for five minutes. Pro tip, add six to eight drops of Revive as needed when Transform becomes too thick and roll in one direction until it is well blended. 
this is going to drink up Revive, so don't be afraid to use it. This was so much fun. Thank you for watching and becoming a Dazzle Dry expert. We appreciate each and every one of you. For more in-depth tips, tricks, and best practices, or to find a Dazzle Dry certified salon near you, please visit our blogs and FAQs at DazzleDry.com. Bye, everyone. Thank you.